Want to see more cool videos on our channel? We do, so press this bell and enable to send notifications. What's the future of the human race and our beloved planet Earth? Humanity has been around for about 200,000 years and has experienced a massive amount of change already. The Bering Land Bridge that once connected Asia and North America with one another has long since been submerged beneath the ocean. So if humanity exists for another billion years, then what additional changes or events can we reasonably expect to happen? We are not fortune tellers, but we've looked deep into the rocky record of our planet's history to find the most surprising things that will happen to Earth in the next billion years. Let's go through this journey together. Holy shit, where's my home? Give or take, in the next 1,000 years from now, all current man-made structures are expected to disappear. Yes, even the Statue of Liberty will have ceased to exist. Spoiler alert for all you original Planet of the Apes fans out there. Due to rapid evolution of languages, no single present-day word will have survived. From then, future languages will only contain one out of every 100 core vocabulary words of their present-day counterparts. Essentially, no modern language will be recognizable by this point. 2,000 years from now, ice sheets will have completely melted with extreme global warming of 8 degrees centigrade. Greenland ice will be melted. Sea levels will be 6 meters higher, which means water, water everywhere. Did you know that 5125 is the year of the end of the Mayan calendar? And according to Mayans, a doomsday. Again. If we survived 5125, then in 20,000 years, Chernobyl will finally be safe. At about 10,000 years into the future, we will encounter the year 10,000 problem. Software that encodes the AD calendar year as a four-digit decimal will no longer be able to encode dates starting at 10,000 AD. It will be a real Y10K. And in addition, if current trends of globalization continues, then human genetic variation will no longer be regionalized by this point, meaning that all human genetic traits like skin color and hair color will be evenly distributed across the world. 50,000 years from now, Niagara Falls disappears. The remaining 32 kilometers to Lake Erie erodes away and the waterfall ceases to exist. 100,000 years from now, the titanium in your MacBook starts to corrode. Either a supervolcano or a large climate-altering asteroid will likely have affected the Earth. The stars in the heaven will look completely different due to the Earth's movement through the galaxy. Also, this is the estimated amount of time that it would take to fully terraform Mars into a habitable planet similar to Earth. In 500,000 years, the spent fuel in today's reactors will finally be safe, and there will be a new global freeze. Earth will have likely been struck by an asteroid measuring one kilometer in diameter, unless humanity artificially prevents it. Additionally, the Badlands National Park in South Dakota will have completely eroded away by this point. In 950,000 years, the meteor crater in Arizona, which is considered the best preserved meteorite impact crater on Earth, will have completely eroded away. In one million years, now all glasses created today will have finally degraded. Massive stone structures like the pyramids at Giza or sculptures at Mount Rushmore may still exist. Everything else, gone. In two million years, the Grand Canyon will have eroded even more significantly, slightly deepening, but it will mostly widen out into a large valley. If humanity has colonized two different planets in the solar system and the universe by this point, and the populations on each planet have remained separate from one another, then humanity will have likely evolved into various different species at this point. These different human species will be adapted to their different planets, and may not be aware of the other human species located in the rest of the universe. Some have proposed that in 5 million years, that Y chromosome could die out, making men impossible. 50 million years from now, Africa will have collided with Eurasia, sealing the Mediterranean basin and creating a mountain range similar to the Himalayas. Antarctica ice migrates north and melts, 
raising sea levels by 75 meters. Don't worry, the entire galaxy could be colonized by that time. In 60 million years, the Earth's orbit will become unpredictable. In 250 million years, the continents will start moving and creating a new supercontinent. 800 million years from now, C4 photosynthesis is no longer possible, destroying all multicellular life. In 1 billion years, a large part of East Africa will split off from the rest of the continent. A new ocean basin will form between the two sides, and Africa will be divided into two separate landmasses. What do you guys think will happen in the next 1 billion years? Let us know in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching, and if you enjoy the video, please let me know by clicking the like button. Do share, write a comment, and don't forget to subscribe so that you can catch up my next video.